I'm from Dominica, but yeah. I'm currently in Atlanta on um, a B1 visa. Okay. Um, my dad is filing for me. However, I'm 81, but I'm I'm 28. Sorry, <laughs> I'm 28 years. Your dad um, filed however, for you in what year? No, my dad. I'm currently 28 years. You're 28 years old, and when did your dad file for you? He hasn't started that yet. Okay, fine. Okay, so what is your question? Okay, I read online somewhere that if I was 18 on February 2001 or after, then it will make the case easier for me. And also, I want to start school, so I don't know if I should apply for a student visa while he's filing, or he should start filing this before I do that, or what should I do? All right. First of all, what you read was the Child Citizenship Act. That has nothing to do with you. Uh, the law changed for the Child Citizenship Act in February 2001 that says if your father's a U.S. citizen and you have a green card and you are under 18 at the time, you would become an automatic U.S. citizen provided you live in his legal custody. That's probably what you were reading. That has nothing to do with you because you don't have a green card, so you don't fall under the Child Citizenship Act. You need a green card. Now, if your dad files for your green card right now, you will not be able to get a student visa because a student visa has a non-immigrant intent, meaning that my intention is to go back home when I'm done. And you can't show mm -hmm. that you're going to go back home when you're done if your dad's already filed for you. So you got to do it in the proper order. If you want to stay here and go to school, get a student visa. After you get the student visa, wait 90 days, and then call me, and then we can talk about what to do next. Okay, cool. All Thank right. you. You're welcome.